हेलो एंड वेलकम टू द ऑफिशियल यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ टाइटेनियम इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ स्पोकन इंग्लिश लैंग्वेज आई एम हिमांशु पालीवालिया आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग परफेक्टली गुड गाइस नाउ वट इज आवर टीम इज अपलोडिंग टू मेनी वीडियोस इवन दो आवर व्यूअर्स आर सजेस्टिंग अस जी डी टॉपिक्स एंड वी आर ट्राइंग टू मेक वीडियोज ऑन डैट टॉपिक्स सो इफ यू हैव इफ यू हैव ऑल्सो सम डिफरेंट टॉपिक्स और यूनिक टॉपिक विच यू वॉन्ट अस टू डिस्कस दैन ऑल्सो मेक श्योर इन कमेंट सेक्शन even though we are also a learner if you find our mistake then also make uh, then also make sure in a comment section so we will try to overcome this mistake so we have a two orator between us one side mr mulli dhar is here another side mr shubham is here they both will discuss on a very tremendous topic that is does india really needs bullet train or not it is a very burning topic we uh, upcoming in upcoming 4 to 5 years so both will share their points they will ask question to each, to each other and if you have any question if you have any suggestion feedback or as well can, i can say it, honest feedback then must share in a comment section so who is going to start you okay so mr mulli please start this topic first of all i said i favor in this topic and uh, my first point is high speed railway is gonna be a uh, technologically and it will help to develop our infrastructure as well as reduce unemployment and my second point is once india get technology from japan india can also exporter of the technology and as well as stocks okay you spoke very well sir but for lying the tracks of bullet trains there would be an issue of land acquisition what would you say about the people whose land will be under the this project first of all it's not a big problem and uh, whose whose land in between the project government give the compensation to the people's whose land in between the project okay so my first point is that cost of construction so the cost of construction for the bullet train is nearly 1.5 lakh crore rupees so i think india should have to focus on gdp more than the bullet trains and my second point is that high fares of bullet trains so one way route fare of mumbai to ahmedabad is around 500 to 5000 rupees so i don't think so that everyone would can afford that much expensive traveling even those people who wants to spend that much amount of money they might prefer traveling by planes absolutely nice point okay. you spoke very well sir but uh, i have a question that is uh, don't you think that sir bullet train will decrease the travel timing and hence increase the connectivity of transportation so sir for speed and connectivity we have the planes too so there is no need to focus on the bullet trains now okay. and what would you say about the high cost of construction of bullet trains it's a good question sir but uh, in this project japan investing 80% in this project and uh, it will not harm our uh, economy directly anything anything okay give i have one question each and everything need a startup so bullet train is also the type of startup in india so what do you think so sir a successful startup for a project means which gives us a life long profits so we very well know the condition of our indian railways now so india have to focus much more on maintenance of trains rather than bullet trains okay nice nice a uh, nice answer given by you okay you both mentioned a very good point if i conclude this topic yes definitely india needs a bullet train but it should be a long term policy what is the long term policy that whenever the construction purpose is start okay then it should be end and it will benefited for a long time okay that will be the benefit for, uh, to implement bullet train in india but the disadvantages are that uh, it will uh, uh, it is it will be costly okay we know that uh, it will be much more costly than uh, aeroplanes also but right now the condition is that uh, in the pandemic after the pandemic the people got unemployment our gdp also got down so we have to improve our gdp also so either implementing the bullet trains in india we should focus on the improvement of our indian railways 
okay so both the points are good i request to our viewers that they have mentioned a very productive points if you have any question even you have any unique point regarding to the advantages or disadvantages then must share in a comment section so thank you so much mr murli thank you so much uh, shubham i request to our viewers if you like our video then must share in a uh, must share to your status and family members and friends thank you for watching